Your odds of winning a billion dollars in tonight's Powerball aren't great, but even a tiny chance is enough to get you daydreaming about what you do with all that money. Stefan Dingle takes a closer look as America burns with lottery fever. With a billion dollars as the prize for the winning ticket, if you're like me or so many others, you've already mentally spent money you don't even have, at least yet. But if you win, what would you spend it on? That's, that's, that's a hell of a question to ask because I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. <laughs> I got to think about something like that. <laughs> with the second largest prize ever for the Powerball at a billion dollars. It's something that is out of my range of even thinking about, but, you know, yeah. we'll give it a shot. Yeah. A lucky shot is all it takes. And when imagination starts to come into play, these folks have all sorts of ways they would spend it. I would be, like, giving away cars left and right, just, like, just so to like friends. Oprah. Yeah. Well, I would take me a vacation. I'm retired right now. I'm from Social Security. I would do things, enjoy life like I'm supposed to enjoy it. Yes. You know, my wife wants to have the house redone, um, vacations, you know, the whole thing. It's, yeah. it's, you know, what anybody else would do. And with the realities of this economy, whether it's inflation, high prices, or personal debt, these same gentlemen also had giving hearts when it came to others. And I think I would pay off all of my friends and family student loans. Wow. Student loans are the number one thing. Give my family some money, give money some to charity, you know what I mean? I'll help some people, you know, people that are dead, unfortunate, you know what I mean? Gotcha. But you can't have it all for yourself, gotcha. you know, by myself. I help the unfortunate out, you know. If you happen to win the Powerball, you can just say hello to your new long-lost cousin. No, but really here in Maryland, if you do win, you can choose to remain anonymous. Good luck. In Canton, I'm Stefan Dingle for WJZ.